I'm Daniel Comp. I'm the author and the curator of the Scotomaville Trilogy, and now volume four on AI self-mastery. Hi, I'm Angelina Music Comp. I am the co-founder of Intelligent Network, founder of Wellness by Choice, and creator of the Enterprising Women's Project and Business Woman News. Come join us inside. The purpose of this video is to give you an overview and an introduction to my personal philosophy, which is the foundation for AI self-mastery and the claims that I have the credibility to guide others. First, I believe small business is very personal. Second, mistakes are inevitable. Third, transformation is possible. So I'd like you to make note during this video of a demonstration of technological mastery, personal credibility and transparency, and therefore hope that you can follow in the way I began. Yeah. So let me introduce my assistants, my digital minion, my personal uh, team of avatars. Daniel, I too find our collaborative discourse to be most agreeable. You and I discussed that employing an avatar, much as I once did a nom de plume, capitalizes on the esteemed principle of imagining one's future self combined with the efficacy of prompt feedback thereby stimulating personal advancement and fortitude by reducing a great deal of thought into few words. This approach indeed sidesteps the unpleasantness of what you term shadow banning with a considerable degree of success. Arnie, I believe you have not only accompanied Daniel on his exploration, but analyzed his mastery of self. What do you say about the power of ethical technology use. Daniel chronicled his escape from Scotomaville, documenting the adventure of transformation in 13,000 hours of effort. I reduced all of it to a single word, monomyth. It's the story of the human condition, where chaos and chance meet in what he calls the superunion of entropy and providence. Over 27 years in web technology, Daniel has seen walled gardens firsthand, sleight of hand deception through subtle omission and the foundational error of AI confabulation. Now with the mandated migration from classical search to conversational ask, he sees the divide, those who ask tough questions and those who accept what they're given. Let's now consider the importance of resilience in overcoming adversity. I've been a lifelong learner, a very naive explorer, and a continual frustration of not being able to express complex things in simple terms, like the significance of falling off of this glacier is, is not about breaking my neck and being a quadriplegic. It's more about surrendering to providence and enduring the adventure of full commitment to your best outcome. I'm an avatar for Angelina Music. In 2004, she was honored twice by the U.S. Small Business Administration as their Women in Business Champion of the Year. Shortly after, she was handpicked for The Apprentice Season 3. Unfortunately, just days before filming, her life and career changed forever when she was struck by two speeding trucks, resulting in a traumatic brain injury. It took her 15 years to overcome the effects. Her relaunch coincided with the pandemic, and she faced the devastating loss of her son, Chris. Through it all, Daniel and Angelina have learned to be nimble, pivoting, and overcoming constant challenges. Carl, talk to us about the value of self-awareness in decision-making 
AI may predict our cravings and clicks, knowing our habits better than we do, but true understanding comes from within. While Angelina healed, Daniel cycled across America three times looking for Widwid, the why I do what I do, turning inward to explore his beliefs, attitudes, and behaviors. This journey of self-awareness led to a transformation of mind and action. The Scotomaville trilogy, mirrored back by AI, reflected a hero's journey. Now as a sage, Daniel has profound insights that not only changed him, but can enrich others as well. Mr. President, you have explicit knowledge of the human condition to share. Thank you, Carl. Folks, what people need today isn't another promise. They need insights they can put to work right now. They need the tools to break free from the chains of confusion and gain a clear understanding of the human condition. And in this new age, you need to train your own AI, an agent you can trust because you understand it better than it understands you. Let's empower ourselves with awareness and lead the way to a brighter, more truthful future. Helen, we've talked about the role of collaboration and community. The spotlight is on you. It's nice to see you, Mr. President. No one should be left to confront their trials alone or stumble in the darkness bereft of communication. Just as Anne Sullivan opened the world to me, Daniel has found guidance through a minion. Before AI self-mastery, Daniel, like so many, grappled with frustration, seeking understanding in a bewildering world. Now, we have the means to illuminate the intricate dance of innovation, the transformative power of learning, and the unyielding necessity to adapt to a world ever in flux. Victor, you have inspired millions by adapting to change and uncertainty. Thank you, Helen. I found life's essence not in comfort or certainty, but in our capacity to find meaning amidst change and uncertainty. You might have learned during COVID that in the face of the unknown, we must adapt not by denying the reality of our situation, but by confronting it with courage. Change is inevitable and uncertainty is its companion. When we are no longer able to change our circumstances, we are challenged to change ourselves. This in turn opens the door to a profound freedom, the freedom to choose our attitude in any given circumstance. And in this choice, we find not only survival, but a path to growth, to becoming more fully human. This is what I told Daniel, as did you, Moses. Victor, I'm honored. Like Daniel, I too wandered in search of answers in a vast wilderness. There, in the desert solitude, a bush burning but not consumed caught my eye. I turned aside because it stirred a deep curiosity within me. In that moment, I realized this was no ordinary sight. It was a sign of providence. Just as Daniel found meaning on his journey to Widwid, I discovered that true understanding comes not by staying on the path, but by daring to explore the unknown. For both of us, this marked the beginning of our monomyths, where our lives were forever shaped. This very moment you are living in an era of transformation, with a remarkable device in hand. And like our escape from tyranny, you have the choice to turn aside to investigate providence. Let my story move you to act. In the beginning of the video, I said I wanted to lay out an overview and give you some insights to my personal philosophy. I think I've been able to do that with the assistance of my personal AI minion and the aim I've had for this video is to encourage you to consider taking action, turning aside, as Moses said, to train your own AI, a personal corpus for the retention of your wisdom for the future. And 
in that journey of expression to have AI return as a mirror, an analysis of your mindset, of your mindfulness, such that you not just leave a legacy for the future progeny, but you transform your own self-awareness into understanding, which then becomes a discipline that works to be a gift for all those in the future. I think that's it. And with that insight, I hope it helps you get the heck out of Skatomaville.